Hey there, I'm the Lightbulb guy and I'm here with another straight to the point WordPress tutorial. So today we'll talk about shortcodes. If you want to use shortcodes for inserting buttons, frames, highlights, lists, spoilers, quotes, video, audio, maps, pop-ups, sliders, animations, content visible only for members, content visible only at a certain time and so much more, I'll show you a free shortcode plugin which will blow you away with all the features it has. Also, if your team doesn't support shortcode in your sidebar widget, I'll show you how to do this really easy. But before that, I want to invite you to join my free course where I'll show you how to increase the revenue from your WordPress website in three simple steps. The course is free, but the results are real, so check it out. Click at the center of this video to join or go to wplightbulb.com slash course. So let's start with the short codes. Obviously you need to know how to install a plugin. If you don't, click here to watch my video explaining this. Then continue watching this one. So the plugin I'm talking about is called Shortcodes Ultimate and it's a mega pack of shortcodes. When you're creating a new post, you see the insert shortcode button. There are a lot, but you can filter them to make it easier to find whatever you're searching for. So, for example, if you want to insert a YouTube video, click on YouTube, paste the video URL and configure the settings you want. Then just click insert shortcode and you're done. One of my favorite shortcodes that comes with this plugin is the animation shortcode. There are plenty of different animations and you can set the duration and delay. And this delay will start counting after the visitor is seeing this place where the animation should appear. So if it's somewhere below the fold, it won't be shown before the visitor is there. Also, you have a lightbox shortcode. This shortcode will include a button and whenever your visitor clicks on the button, a pop-up will appear. In this pop-up, you can include a URL, image or custom HTML. Another interesting shortcode is the scheduler. With this feature, you can make content visible only in a certain day of the week, for example, or anytime you want. You can also insert a Google map with just a few clicks. Go to Gmap and choose the size of your map. Then just type the address and click insert shortcode. And yeah, there are a lot of different shortcodes here. I think this is the biggest collection of shortcodes. The plugin is free, but it's better than some paid ones. So install it and play with it a little bit. You'll get used to it really fast. Now, if you want to insert a shortcode in your sidebar widget, but your team doesn't support this, all you have to do is install the Use Shortcodes in Sidebar Widgets plugin. After that, your shortcodes will work in the widgets. So pretty much that's it for today's video. Install the plugin and you will be able to create super awesome things in your content with just a few clicks. This is great for everybody who hates code like me. Thank you for watching. If you found this video useful, please hit the thumbs up button. Also subscribe to my channel for more straight to the point WordPress tutorials. And if you are still not a member of my course, take advantage of it. You could be able to double your income in as little as 7 days. Click at the center of this video to start now. See you there.